Farmers, how's it going? FBR here, Farm Boy Reef. Um, so today's episode, I'm going to show you guys the pH uh, tester from Sulfur as well. I showed you guys how to do the calcium, and I showed you guys how to do the magnesium test. So we're going to do the third one tonight. Um, it's very important with pH in your reef tank. Uh, it's good for coral growth. You don't want it. You don't want it spiking and lowering all the time. Usually at night during the day it spikes and then by morning it starts to fall. So the best or the best you could have is try to keep it like a peak all the time. It's best for your corals, they really, they really like that. So I'm just gonna show you how easy it is to use this pH tester. Um, the other thing is you want, always wanna to try to keep your pH between 7.8 and 8.0. That's your ideal mark that you wanna keep your pH in your reef tank. So let's get started and I'm gonna unpack this and show you guys how to do this. So I got everything unpacked here. So it comes with a, a little vial to put your uh, aquarium water in. It comes with the solution, the pH Marine, that comes in your box. And it comes with a five milliliter syringe. So, and it comes with uh, a chart here. It shows you what, after you do your test, to compare. And then we're looking for the ideal like 8.0 in this green color here. So let's go ahead and do this test. So I got some aquarium water here. So we're gonna fill up our syringe for five mil. All right. So see the mark on here, you wanna fill it to five mil. So I'm just gonna, I got too much, so I'm just gonna take some out. All right, tap the bubbles up. So there we go, you guys can see right there, five mil. So what we're gonna do, I'm just gonna put this to the side. I'm gonna fill, fill up your vial with the five mil. All right guys, this is a pretty simple one. This one's pretty fast. So there we go, that was our vial. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the pH Marine, give a little shake, and we're gonna add five, we're gonna have five, there's actually six drops of this into here. So let's count them. Everybody watch. So just to start off to the side, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, pull that off so we don't drop one more drop than we have to. All right, and it says shake. If you read your instructions here, it comes with little instructions here. Now it's gonna say, add the six drops of your pH marine solution. And then it says you're gonna swirl, swirl gently for uh, 10 seconds. So let's do that. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. So now we're gonna take. You guys can see this. It's like a little bit of like a green color. We gotta match it with this. So if we look here, the guys together, can you guys see what it looks more like? See, 8.0. So my tank looks like it's right on the money. It's hard to show you guys, but you can see the color here. In here, would you guys would you guys agree that's an 8.0? I would. So 8.0. So my tank is doing good right now. What I would usually do is for a week, I would take the test, take the test in the morning, and then take the test at night. Do it two times a day, so you can see where you're fluctuating, where your pH is going low and where your pH is going high. So and then you can buffer that. You can get different uh, powders and sort of solutions, or do things naturally to keep your pH in the range at all the time. But you want to keep that peak always high and never falling. So just do a week, keep a journal diary like I do. I have it in my other one. I showed you guys my book doing my magnesium. I'll do the same with this. So that's how you do the, that's how you do the pH uh, test from our Celebrate. You get 50 tests. It cost me uh, 17, 17.99 at my local fish store. But that's a pretty simple, easy test and you guys should be doing that. And uh, so there, that's an 8.0. So, you know, thanks for watching uh, FBR guys. This is the episode of uh, pH testing. I hope it's very helpful to you guys. Please leave a comment, message, uh, hit the subscribe button. All right, guys, I really appreciate it. Uh, have a good night. Bye.